Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick, and today they released uh, the new Final Edition cards. Uh, this will probably be a short video, uh, just going over them. Uh, it's not going to be too in-depth because they're not all on the auction. And uh, I don't know why, and not that they're rare, but they're kind of expensive, so the prices are a little bit off. So first we got Kenny Stills, who was second on the team in receiving touchdowns. Has decent. I would have liked to see him have 96 or 97 speed. Um, just because that's pretty much all the Saints used him for was throwing it deep. So, in Mad and Mutt, you need a little bit faster to do deep throws. 94 is a little slow. Next, we got Austin Pastor, uh, right tackle for the Jaguars. He's got a bunch of decent stats, nothing that's going to blow you away right there, but mid 80s, uh, mid to high 80s on all his stats. Demario Davis, middle linebacker for the Jets, has some good tackling at 93, good pursuit 92, and good agility at 90. I compare that with like the Patrick Peterson or something, get him up to 90 speed and 92 agility, something like that, or you know anything like that. Um, and last we've got free safety Rodney McLeod, uh, 92 speed, which is pretty pretty decent. It's good to decent for a safety. Uh, Okay zone, pretty decent man, pretty good play rec, uh, decent tackling, press doesn't necessarily matter. So all in all, not bad. You get the uh, Marcel Darius uh, final edition. And if you look at this, all of them are 95s except Alshon Jeffrey, which I don't quite understand. But uh, hopefully they start releasing maybe a few that are a little bit higher, but we'll have to see. Let me go over this real quick. See if I can find them. Elite wide receiver. Kenny Stills has not been up. So I haven't been able to find him. Let me see. Maybe they have it jacked up. Uh, no. He just isn't up. That's great. So I can't show you the price of Kenny Stills on the auction. So next I will go to... Right tackle for the Jags. There he is. Austin Pastor. The, this is day one. They only came out about four or five hours ago, so uh, this isn't like a reflection of what you'll have to pay if you wait until next week or even later because they don't ever take the final editions out, I don't believe. So uh, he'll probably go under 5K at some point, so you'll be able to do that pretty easy. Uh, middle linebacker for the Jets. There is only one Demario Davis up, and it is 50,000 coins. So obviously, this collection, just with that Demario Davis, is not worth doing at the moment. Uh, right outside land, now let's see here. Free safety for the Rams. This is the last card. There he is, Rodney McLeod. He is only 12, well, not only, but he's 12K, uh, which compared to the others aren't bad, but... Still would wait quite some time before I do this collection. Uh, I wanted to do I want to do the Alshon Jeffrey collection. I don't know if I really want the card, but I just kind of want to do it. And so the big one was the Ezekiel Ansa. His price is always pretty high. 12k, it's coming down, but I don't want to pay more than like 15, 16k for that Alshon Jeffrey. So I'm gonna hold off on that. What just happened? I got outbitted on Chris Harris. Uh, but I think I'm going to come up with a video a little bit later, either tomorrow or the day after, just uh, showing you guys how I make my coins and whatnot. That was a little sneak peek of my team uh, that I will be doing another updated video because I've changed so much. Because uh, big shout out to, uh, I think it was John Paul Perry. Uh, he hooked me up with a free Brian Dawkins Uh and so I was, was able to sell my Sean Taylor and get about, f I think I got 400,000 coins for it with tax. So I, I got 400, I think what, I sold them for 440,000. And then or 440, something like that. I sold them for enough that after tax I got 400,000. And so I was able to make huge adjustments to my team. I did a little sniping and got some good snipes and whatnot. So I'll go over some of those. I'll do a whole coin thing video and let you guys know what what you need to do and all that. And also have that new lineup. I'll probably do it next Wednesday or Thursday. I'll probably do, wait. I'm I'm probably gonna do it on a day where there's no new content. So probably Tuesday will be when I upload an updated 
team thing because my my team is pretty pretty changed. It's really changed actually. Other than the linebackers, the D line, the fullback, that might be it. That there's not a change. And tight end, tight end. Those are about it. That's not changed. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Drop a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't. I'm going to continue to try to get gameplay. I can't find games online. Like, it's completely retarded. Um, I try to search, and I'll search for like 20 minutes, and I can't find anything. So that's the reason why I haven't uploaded any Ultimate Team gameplay. But yeah, I will catch you all later. Peace out, guys.